Welcome! So OpenAI just tweeted, our new text-to-image model Dolly 3 can translate nuanced requests into extremely detailed and accurate images. Coming soon to ChatGPT Plus in Enterprise, which can help you craft amazing prompts to bring your ideas to life. Well, uh, this is nothing short of amazing. And they were so cool to attach some images which they've created with prompts uh, using Dolly 3. So, like, this is an illustration of a human heart made of translucent glass standing on a pedestal amidst a stormy sea. Rays of sunlight pierce the clouds, illuminating the heart, revealing a tiny universe within. The quote, find the universe within you is etched in bold letters across the horizon. <laughs> this is, this is this is crazy! <laughs> this is crazy! Can you see this? Oh my god. What have we become? And wait, there's more! A modern architectural building with large glass windows situated on a cliff overlooking a serene ocean at sunset. Oh my god. And there's another one. Tiny potato kings wearing majestic crowns sitting on thrones overseeing the vast potato kingdom <laughs> filled with potato subjects in potato castles. See, this is this is what it's made for. It's it's for potatoes. What else do you want to use it for? It's the potato kingdom. Oh, and there's this. I don't want to read it. It's too long. A 2D animation of a folk music band composed of anthrop anthropomorphic autumn leaves, each playing traditional bluegrass instruments amidst rustic forest setting dappled with the soft light of a harvest moon. You know, you know what? This is gonna destroy some some uh, illustrator jobs. You know, when you go to to a marketing agency and you know what? I want a to do animation of a folk music band composed of anthropomorphic autumn leaves, each playing a traditional bluegrass instruments amidst rustic forest, setting up with the soft light of harvest moon, and they will say, okay, just give us a day or two or a week. But you know, ChatGPT doesn't need a week. He will just spit out like four images, five, six, I don't know how many in five seconds. It's this is crazy. So what's next? This is the leaves. Photo of a lychee inspired spherical chair with bumpy white exterior and plush interior set against a tropical wallpaper. See, design is dead. This is gonna overtake everything, photographic, whatever, everything. Look at this. We used to cherish authors uh, drawing things like this. And now on me, I can do it in seconds. And it's just as good, if if not better than... Oh god, look at this. I don't, I'm not even gonna read it, the prompts. Look at this. So there you go, if you, have, if you were a graphic designer, or like you were drawing things, then... God bless. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, man. This is this is gonna be you, you're gonna be a tough battle, and and it's not even over. I was told there's a video. Where is it? I wonder how far they can push this. I wonder. I wonder if they can s one day connect the the coding ability with the with the with the drawing with animations and whatever, and they just it's just gonna. You're just gonna tell him to make me a video game and it's gonna just make you a video game with completely new graphics and then kill the video game industry because, you know, you're just gonna prompt out what do you want. I'm absolutely convinced this is the future. Maybe not in 10 years, but coding is going to be redundant. Coding is going to be only to refine AIs. There is going to be no point to create games anymore. What for? Then AI can do it for you. You just give in the details and there you go, there you have a video game for you. It will create it for you as you like it. Can you imagine like a video game, AI video game sharing service? Look, I made this video game last night with ChatGPT 16. Here you go. Oh man, what a nice game. I mean, I don't say I don't like it. It's, it's kind of cool, but there's going to be a big shift in coding. Big, big, big shift. Certain areas are going to be completely useless, completely useless. Just give it some time, take a look at this. My five-year-old keeps talking about a super duper sunflower hatcher. What does it look like? Oh my... Oh my god. What? 
Can you show me Larry being kind-hearted? Sure, here you go. Could you design some stickers? No problem, here you go. The product lineup is ready. Right now is maybe a 300 people working to get the complete the franchise ready. <laughs> Here you go, ChatGPT has that in control. It's, let's give him rights to order on Amazon and he will order you the stickers. Or better yet, let's give him a factory access so he can make production. Oh my god. Can you make this a bad time? Sorry, it's no problem. There you go. Oh my god, here we go, it's happily dreaming, there you go. Oh Jesus Christ. This is a great show for like what AI can do at the very moment and how rapidly it evolves. But can you imagine a world where, as I said before, like video games are made with AI and you have these AI share, utopistic, whatever. And here you go, this is my game. I wrote it for two weeks, you know, and by wrote, I mean, I wrote the prompts. I'm in for it. You know, I, I don't know why I kind of, I kind of like the idea, but then again, I'm very sorry for those who like do video games, but it's probably isn't going to be a shift like in two seconds, but the marketing or the, like the design agencies, well, and that's a different topic. That's a different topic because artists who were making like images like this or anything graphic based, they're going to have a problem here. And I feel like there is more coming. There is a lot more coming. Eventually they, they figure out the video game. They will figure out how to, how to like, see, they, it figured out how to make uh, bedtime stories. No problem. You don't need books. It will write books for you. Whatever you want. What do you want? I want some science fiction. Give me one. Here you go, buddy. 300 pages. Do you want me to read it for you? Yes, sure. Imagine. It's no time. Make movies, games, whatever. Oh, it's crazy. We humans are going to work for the AI. Or maybe I'm just a little bit too excited, but uh, I don't know. I never imagined in 50 years ago that I'm going to see something like this. I've imagined that this is not going to happen in my lifetime. And see, it's here. So given a few years, I don't know what to expect. I don't know what to expect. Look at this. This was the old Dolly. It was already extremely powerful. And now this is the new one. No problem. So this is one of the greatest achievements in our modern AI world, I think. So there. This is, these are my thoughts on this topic. I'm kind of a little bit of afraid, but excited too, to see what's coming next. And I'm a little bit sorry for those who made a living from creating these images, because there is surely going to be a shift in this, because if the AI can do it, then, well, people might as well just turn to the AI. It's faster, it's cheaper, and you know, that's what matters, unfortunately. But thank you very much for watching the video. Uh, leave a like, like, and subscribe, of course. Subscribe, what are you waiting for? Hit the button and see you in the next one. Bye.